Hi guys, George here from the Royal Army's Education Team, bringing you another edition of the Home Learning Hub, and this time we'll be exploring Saxon shield walls. But who were the Saxons? Well, the Saxons were the group of people who lived in Britain from AD 450 up until 1066, when William the Duke of Normandy and the Normans conquered England. Now, sometimes Saxons would fight in battles, sometimes even against Vikings. Now what do you think a brave and strong Anglo-Saxon warrior would use to fight with in a battle? A sword? Perfect. What else might they use? A spear. I like it. Maybe even a spear like this. This is a spear that's found from around the Anglo-Saxon times. Now, I've got a harder question for you guys. What do you think a brave and strong Anglo-Saxon warrior would use to defend themselves when they're fighting in a battle? A shield, perfect. Now, at the Royal Armouries, we don't have any Anglo-Saxon shields in our collection, but we do know how they might have used them because of this. Now, this here is the Bayer Tapestry, and it's a 70 metre long embroidery that tells us the history of 1066 and the conquering of England. And it also shows us what Anglo-Saxon shields might have looked like and how they might have used them. It shows us they might have used them to make shield walls. What is a shield wall? Well, a shield wall is a military tactic used by armies throughout history, and it looks something like this. A group of soldiers will line up, and they'll be really close to each other, really compact, and they'll be shoulder to shoulder. Which meant if the soldier next to you had bad breath, tough luck, you're going to smell what he had for his lunch. And you'll be standing really close to each other with your shields out like this. And each shield will overlap the other one. I tell you what, now you know what a shield wall is. Why don't we make one? That means you need to grab yourself a shield. So I'm going to tell you some things you shouldn't use as a shield, and I'm going to tell you some things you should use as a shield. So here's some things you should not use as a shield. Your mum and dad's favourite record. A hula hoop. A sieve. Or a colander. And here's some things you could use as a shield. A baking tray. A frying pan. A saucepan lid. Okay. So now I know what you should and shouldn't use. I want you to go and find a shield in your house. Make sure you check with your adults first you're allowed to use it. Pause this video and once you have your shield, come back and join me here. Okay guys, do you have your shield? Perfect. Stand up for me and take a step back into some space. Now imagine you're an Anglo-Saxon warrior in a shield wall. Either side of you are your fellow soldiers. You can hear them breathing. You can hear their hearts beating out of their chest because in front of you are the horrible Viking army. You can see the whites in their eyes and it's terrifying you to the core. But we must attack. We must move forward as a shield wall. So, when I say forward, you'll take a step forward and you'll let out an almighty hoo! Like this. Hoo! Okay, are you ready? Three, two, one. Forward! Oh, come on guys, that was rubbish. The Vikings are laughing at you. Come on, try harder, you're Anglo-Saxon warriors. Take a step back. Three, two, one, forward! <gasps> Much better. And we're getting closer to the enemy, but there's still room to be closer. Three, two, one, forward! <gasps> Do you think we're close enough? I think we can get even closer. Three, two, one, Woo! Look how close we are to the Viking enemy. You can see the whites in their eyes. You can see the bogeys in their nose. You can see what they had for breakfast in between their teeth. And this is how close you would get if you're fighting in a shield wall. Imagine being this close to a Viking warrior. How would that make you feel? I'd feel pretty scared. You did a brilliant job in that shield wall, guys. Well done. Now here's what I want you to do. I want you to test your shields. If you have access to a garden, go outside and get someone to throw a wet sponge towards you. Defend yourself using your shield and try and keep dry. If you don't have access to a garden, get someone to gently throw a cushion or a pillow towards you. Again, defend yourself with your shield and protect yourself. And once you've done that guys, I want you to do some writing. I want you to imagine you're an Anglo-Saxon warrior who's just been fighting in a shield wall against the Vikings. I want you to write a diary extract from their point of view of what they saw, what it felt like, and if they were victorious or not in the battle. 
And once you've written it, guys, why don't you send it to the Royal Armoury's social media accounts? Because we'd love to be able to read them. So thank you guys for watching, keep learning, and see you soon.